So it's a brand new year, welcome to 2022, and we're back once again on r slash Terraria to check out the latest artwork and memes from the community. So let's jump into it. So starting off with nearly 18,000 upvotes, Terraria won the Labour of Love Award for Steam, and how good it feels to finally be able to say that. Yeah, they won, and it's all thanks to you lot for heading to Steam and actually voting for them. This is an award that Terraria should have won a couple of times by now, but thanks to you lot, it finally happened, and what a way to start the year. I bet Relogic are, like, properly buzzing right now. Oh, you want to see weird, suitable houses? Hell yeah, I do. This housing is suitable. What is that? What? <laughs> that doesn't look right to me, all right? What NPC wants to live there? Maybe, uh, the goblin, okay? Uh, <laughs> so is it just hoiking? Does hoiking actually, like, properly count? Because technically these are blocks, they're just, they're just kind of sloped. This one's a little bit mad, though. <laughs> I don't know, don't know about this one. I don't know who I would put in this one. Probably the angler. This housing is suitable. This is terrible. You lot, you lot are evil. The seven deadly sins of Terrarians. Okay. Uh, lust. Um, tch, sure. Maybe some, maybe some. Uh, gluttony, so lots of potions, lots of food. Uh, greed. Greed's kind of interesting. I wouldn't have used, like, iron bars for greed. I'd have used, like, max luminite. Uh, sloth, okay. We've all done it. An AFK farm. Uh, wrath. That's a pretty good one. Envy. Yes. Like, I'm envious of you lot for always getting rod of discords when I get nothing. And then also... Pride, and I love that you put the Terra Prism in there. This is really good. I made Terraria on Scratch. So if I remember right, Scratch is a website where you can play mini games that people have created. Uh, it's a little bit past my time. When I was a kid, it was all about like mini clips and stuff like that. Uh, so let's see your imitation of Terraria. Already, you've done a fairly good job. This is a little bit different, but that's fine. Small, medium, or large. You know what, honestly, this isn't too dissimilar from actually looking at Terraria's Alpha. Terraria's Alpha was kind of already this scuffed. It's a little bit laggy, all right? It's a little bit laggy, but it works. It does the job. Um, what else have you got? <laughs> it's not bad. It's not bad for a little, for a little, like, website game. Come on. So, Red actually did leave a comment on this. He put, hold on, let me forward this to my lawyers. Uh, what did you say your name and address was again? <laughs> Red's gone full zenith on this kid. I feel sorry. Um, Scratch fan put, okay. Uh, and Red responded, I kid. It's funny though. I made Super Mario Bros. X and got shut down before making Terraria. You seem talented. Don't waste that copying me. Make your own game and put it on Steam. That's kind of, it's kind of wholesome, you know? Still a little bit menacing, Red, not gonna lie. Even if I was drowning, I would never use this. Uh, it's the spiked inner tube. Can you really get that reforge on an inner tube? Look at that. That is menacing. It kind of reminds me of the belt that guy once wore in Sherlock, the BBC version. Bit of a niche reference, but to ruin an episode, the guy had, like, a belt with, like, a fine needle on it. So, like, as he wore it throughout the... Nobody cares. <laughs> Nobody cares. I forgot to say this while recording, but something you should care about is subscribing. This year, we're trying to hit 1 million subscribers, so head down there and consider clicking that button. You've heard it all before, but come on. Um, <laughs> it's been nearly 11 years. It's, it's gone on too long. I am still evaluating whether I beat the boss first try. So, what's your thoughts on this? The player was slain, clearly, as they killed the boss. Does it count? Does it not count? I would say it counts. You got lucky. You know, that final shot, it technically landed. You won. I'd say hold your head up high and just be proud of that. Um, I love it when this happens. I feel like it's almost more, it's more difficult to die at the same time the boss dies than it is to get a clean sweep. So I would say well done, all right? You get the my approval award. Red, back at it again. Man, Red loves Reddit at the minute. Uh, it counts. Hell yeah, Red. All right, that's, you know, kind of upstaging my award, but, you know, great to hear. Terraria 1.4 just released on Switch, and I made a build to celebrate. So it did. 1.4 is finally out, if you haven't checked it out already. I've been playing it for the past day. It's really good. Oh my god, this is incredible. This is so cool. Look at the yo-yos for thumbsticks. That is so awesome. This, like, 
tiny Terraria building aspect that people have started is, is incredible. Look at it. It's so good. It's so good. This might be one of my favorite posts I've ever seen, and I really mean that. It does a lot with a little, and I think that's great. I feel like I have to constantly scroll down now to see if Red is commented, uh, and the sticks are already drifting. This replica is really accurate. No joke, though. It looks dope. Yeah, I realize that my Joy-Cons are drifting. As I've been playing, it's really annoying because I'm, like, navigating the menu, so then the cursor just goes whoop, and it's stop. <laughs> stop. So while on the topic of Switch, I did want to show you a quick little bit of gameplay that I uploaded to Twitter. Now, the footage is going to look a lot worse because I uploaded it from the Nintendo Switch, but it's so cool to see just how well this port actually runs. Uh, so here I am on my expert world that I had from the last time I played through on Switch. Uh, and look at me, look. I'm just flying around. Empress of Light is doing a thing. I've got all the special effects on. I've got a full mini map up in the upper right. And it just works. It just works. And I'm like, I'm actually amazed by it because even though The Witcher 3 can run on Switch, it doesn't mean we're going to get a good port of Terraria on Switch, but they've actually done it. And it kind of blows my mind. Here's to 10 more years of love, creativity, and fun. Congrats for the Labor of Love Award. Hell yeah. I do wonder if Relogic are going to get this Labor of Love award and be like, well, we did it. Terraria is finally done. We have the award. You know, everything's settled. You know, we can bow our heads with pride. Or, or they're like, ah, people love us. <laughs> Let's make 1.5. Maybe it will be useful for someone. Let's see what the video is. So they're using block swap to replace the sand. And then they're able to get underneath the sand. That's already pretty good. Oh, oh, okay. So I didn't realize that uh, sand actually breaks on a minecart track. So I would say I learned something, and you did too. Watch out, honey. He's got a knife. It's the violent step stool. That's right. This is for, for all the people that say the step stool is a bad accessory, all right? He's armed himself. He's prepared. This is brilliant. Reforges are so straight. Overhauling the ocean biome from the spirit mod. I love the spirit mod. I have not played it in a while, but it's a banger mod. Uh, wow. I tell you what, this looks a little bit more like Terraria overhaul than anything else. Yeah, looks good. I like the physics. I like the, the filters. Looks very good. I almost feel like it, it's, it's clearly better than regular Terraria, let's be honest. I really hope that one day we do get an ocean update. I feel like there's so much potential for it. It could use so much more love. Happy New Year, Terrarians. All right, so they've got 2022 here. Uh, I don't really like how menacing this is, though. I feel like you've got a little bit of bad aura to the year. Uh, the King Slime thing is, is really cool. And they've even got, like, the, the ball drop as well. Yeah, sick. What did you do for New Year's? Let me know in the comment down below. I've been experimenting a bit with titanium armor set bonus. So for those who don't know, this is the armor where you have, like, the spinny things going around you. Uh, are you playing a mobile? No, okay, it's just zoomed in. Whoa, look at that. Tell you what, why bother with that when you can use explosive bunnies, as we learned in my last video? Bring the eyeball down, bring it down. Oh, <laughs> there we go. There we go. Oh my God. For some reason, my camera stopped recording, so here's another video to click on if you want something else to watch. See you in the next one. Peace.